Good morning class. I am Kamini Jha from KV Jamalpur and today I am going to present a video on the lesson 3 little pigs from class 1 Marigold. Once there were 3 little pigs Sonu, Monu and Gonu. Sonu lived in a house of straw, Monu lived in a house of sticks and Gonu lived in a house of bricks. One day a big bad wolf came to Sonu's house. He said I will huff and puff and will blow your house down. So he huffed and he puffed and he blew the house down. Sonu ran to Monu's house. The wolf came to Monu's house. He said, I will huff and puff and I will blow your house down. So he huffed and he puffed and he blew Monu's house down. Sonu and Monu ran to Gonu's house. The wolf came to Gonu's house. He said, I will huff and puff and I will blow your house down. So he huffed and he puffed but he could not blow the brick house down. He, it was very strong. The wolf went away and Sonu, Monu and Gonu lived happily together in the red brick house. The meaning of the story is, ki is mein, there, there were three friends. Is mein teen dost hote hain, Sonu, Monu and Gonu. जो सोनू होता है वो स्ट्रॉ के घर में रहता है मतलब पाइप्स के घर में जो मोनू है वो स्टिक्स के घर में रहता है लकड़ी के बने हुए होते हैं और गोनू जो होता है वो पत्थर के घर में रहता है ईंटों के घर में रहता होता है तो एक बार एक जो वुल्फ होता है लोमड़ी जो होती है वो वहां पर आती है और सोनू के सोनू को बोलती है कि मैं फूक मारकर तुम्हारा घर उड़ा दूंगी एंड जब फूक मारती है क्योंकि उसका घर स्ट्रॉ का बना होता है वो उड़ जाता है वो दोबारा फिर सोनू भागते भागते मोनू के पास आता है जो वुल्फ होती है वो दोबारा मोनू को भी यही बात बोलती है और उसका घर भी स्टिक का बना होता है इसलिए वो घर भी उड़ जाता है उसके बाद सोनू और मोनू दौड़ते हुए गोनू के पास आते हैं एंड वुल्फ जो है सेम बात गोनू को भी बोलती है कि वो फूक मार के उसका घर उड़ा देगी पर वो घर नहीं उड़ पाता क्योंकि वो घर ईटों का बना होता है एंड जो वुल्फ होती है वो एंड में वहां से चली जाती है और वो तीनों मिलकर सोनू मोनू एंड गोनू उस रेड ब्रेक हाउस में साथ साथ रहने लगते हैं अब बात आती है न्यू वर्ड्स की इसमें जो न्यू वर्ड्स मेंशन है दैट आर एंड मींस और बैड मींस बुरा बिग मींस बड़ा बट मींस लेकिन नॉट मींस नहीं वन मींस एक पिग सुअर दैट इज एन आर्टिकल एंड वॉज जब हम पास्ट के लिए यूज करते था नाउ वी कैन फ्रेम देंटेंसेज यूजिंग दीज वर्ड्स एंड मी एंड यू आर गुड फ्रेंड्स बैड आई एम नॉट बैड बिग दिस इज अ बिग हाउस बट आई वॉन्ट टू गो बट आई एम टायर्ड नॉट आई एम नॉट इंटरेस्टेड वन I have one big apple. Pig. I don't like pigs. The. The Taj Mahal is very beautiful. Was. I was dancing. We can take the help of the students so that they can come with more sentences and more examples. Next, what we can do is after reading the chapter, we should repeat that again and again, and later on we should discuss about the question answers. How many pigs were there? So there were three pigs. Sonu, Monu and Gonu. What did the big wolf say in the, to the pigs? The big wolf said, I will huff and puff and I will blow your house down. Then let's talk. It's not meant for the writing section but it's better to interact with the students so that they can take the interest in the classes and they can interact. Was the wolf good or bad? According to me, it was bad. What is your house made of? My house is made of brick. Who is good and who is bad? Let them decide. Now there are some imagination part. Imagine you are at home when the wolf hops and puffs. This is for the discussion and it can take long time. Act out the story of the wolf and three pigs. The story has been enacted in the form of a poem on the YouTube by various uh, YouTube makers. I'm sh I'll share the link with you so that you can take the help of the students. 
it uh, and it will be beneficial for your class and to in, uh, encourage their interest next is say aloud the numbers 1 2 3 4 5 we can use the gest gestures as well or the things for that Let's draw. So they have mentioned a house in the picture at uh, on page eleven. We can ask them to trace using the numbers and then color it. The next is the uh, domestic animals and the I mean sorry the farm animals and the jungle animals. The, those are called wild animals. There are some examples given on the different pages, and we can you take the help of this and we can ask them to just uh, match. from the the animals from the farm or the jungle animals or we can take the youtube help and we can show them some farm and domestic uh, domestic animals and jungle animals examples and there there is one poem which has been mentioned bow bow says the dog mew mew says the cat bleat bleat says the goat roar roar says the lion hello hello says the child we can even take example of old macdonald which is very be beneficial and interesting for the kids i hope my class was interactive and beneficial for you thank you and have a good day